flowers, we got the cake, and we're still under the wedding budget. What's next? I just went one more stop. I booked Gerald Finch. Uh, is that like a band or? The clothes. I'm Gerald Finch. I'm the premier napkin folder in all of South Southwestern Utah. I assume you two are the happy couple. Oh my God, chills. <laughs> so you like fold napkins with like flowers and ducks and stuff? Oh no no no. They, he works magic. Just just watch. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh my god, that looks just like a basketball. <laughs> I think it's just a basketball. <laughs> yeah, that's what I just said. But it looks just like a real basketball. Oh, okay, well, if you aren't the sporty kind of WLW, I got a bunch of stuff that I can do for you. I, I got a, a banjo, I got a paperclip. I even have a pretty little butterfly in my repertoire. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I forgot how to do the pretty little butterfly. Isn't he amazing? Everyone is going to be so excited if you manage to book a napkin for me. And you can get me at a huge discount if you let me come to your wedding, set me up right in front, and give me a big, big bowl of olives. I don't think I want you at a wedding. Oh, sure you do. Come on, I can even do my own Adderall prescription. <laughs> ah! Okay, now that is amazing. That is a napkin. That's not a napkin. Okay, okay, all right, listen, babe, babe. I know that this is a big commitment. It's a huge first step for us, and I know that it's scary, but at the end of the day, we're choosing each other, and that's all that matters to me. Plus, if we don't book Gerald, we're gonna have a huge gap in our budget, and then we're gonna have to book like a band or something. Wait, you don't have a band? Whoa, I'm sensing a little bit of tension here. Don't worry, I have just the thing. Watch this, get ready, get ready. Pull, pull. Whoa! It's Jess! Hey guys, so psyched to be here. You remember Jess? <laughs> it's a girl you both dated at separate times in college and haven't talked about since. Come on, you gotta remember Jess. Picture this, a Jess on every place Matt in the whole wedding, a Jess on every guest's lap. Not only can Jess prevent spills, but she can also regale your guests with tales of that time you went to an Indigo Girls concert and performed middling cunnilingus in the woman's bathroom. It was good. Yeah, decent at best. And all that can be yours for the low, low price of letting this man come to your wedding because he has a lot of questions about how two ladies kiss. Who uses tongue? <laughs> Does anything like happen in the, in the breast area? Does both of you cry after, or does no one cry after? Babe, I don't think I want to hire this guy. Can you consider other options? Like, maybe can we look at a little magician? Okay, fine. Don't have to pick Gerald, and I'll look into getting a magician later in the week. Thank you. Damn it, Gerald! Did it again! Stupid, stupid, stupid! Come on, you don't have to say every thought that pops into your head! Think! Is it true? Is it helpful? Is it inspiring? Is it necessary? Is it real? Um, a picture of old me on this napkin. A starry-eyed old kid, still full of passion for his craft, unaware of what would be taken away from him. His family. Isn't that a picture of your dad from right before you went out to get napkins and never came back? <laughs> well, well, that can't be. I mean, this is a picture of, of me right before I realized what I'd lost. <laughs> dad? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Do you want to shoot some hoops? Never ask. Let's go! Damn. 
Um, thank you guys so much for coming. But before you head out, um, my friend Isaac has an apology statement that he wants to read for you. So don't okay. laugh. This is serious. Um, hi. I would like to publicly apologize for my bungling of Isabel's really good Indigo Girls joke. Um, the sketch about the napkin folder uh, after Abby, the name of one of her people, insisted that the cunnilingus in the bathroom of the Indigo Girls concert was good, I was supposed to say, it was closer to fine. <laughs> I apologize for depriving you all of this moment. 